Hey everybody, welcome back. My name is Corner. We're playing Paper Mario. Last time we got the snowman to open this lovely, lovely fortress, and we listened to that one wizard girl go on and on about how the Ice Palace is such a great place. This time we have a new enemy. Pretty sure this is the Ice Club, but eh, I'm probably wrong. Oh, White Club, but I'm not guessing that. Look at that. Yeah, so... How are you guys been doing? No one will answer, but that's okay. Yeah, these guys aren't really that strong. Once you just get their timing down, which I clearly have not yet, it'll be pretty easy. These guys are... They just have stronger attack power. You've already seen it at the top right of the screen. But yeah. So, yeah, we're making a lot of progress. But it's crazy to think that we're in the 40s already. I know we started in October, so technically I should be done right now, by now, but, you know, this is awesome. I can't believe we made it this far already. I thought I would give up by the, at this point, but now we're still up and kicking. But anyways, guess what? It's another super block. And since we have no more new party members coming up, we have three options. Bombette, Cooper, and Goombario. And right now, actually... We are going to be using a little bit more Cooper later on. So it would be best if I upgraded him right now. So that he can have his maximum attack power going forward. But yeah. I'm really excited to see where we go from here. Because I've already decided my next Let's Play and it's this is really cool. Yeah, we're just going to skip right through these because when I went back and healed, I got a, some mushrooms. That is really actually... Pretty good, we got an Ultra Mushroom and two regular Mushrooms. But this Ultra Mushroom heals 50 HP. So I'm only gonna use this Ultra Mushroom for very bad experiences. Like, if I really, really need it. Also, as you can see, I'm at 82 star points. So yeah, we are making a lot of progress. But anyways, let's go climb up these stairs. And yeah, let's put that Star Stone right into the spot. So yeah, we're never going to be able to go back into that cave. It's too late now. Yeah, this this goes pretty high. It's crazy. And we have made it. Alright, so let's climb up these stairs, huh? We're getting really close to a second level up in this chapter. A white, another white club, and the first strike. That's a great start. So yeah, since we're getting so close to a level up, I'm just not going to hold back at all. Oh yeah, since these are all... We should not be seeing many more flying enemies coming up. I can only think of like two. So Cooper is going to be good in this situation for now. And besides, we get to show off his... Yeah, his new attack. He attacks all enemies on the ground with a flaming shell. I want to see it. Yeah. Oh, eight damage! That's amazing! That's 12 experience points, one more match, and then we've leveled up. We haven't even gotten to the boss area yet. We're not even close to the boss area. We have a whole dungeon we gotta still go through. We take this, and we get the Mega Jump Badge. The best jumping badge in the game. That is basically like our Mega Hammer, except for jumping. As you can see, it takes... Where is it? It takes up 3 BP. So I've decided we're going to get rid of Power Bounce and I Spy, because so far I Spy has not helped me in any way at all. And now we have Mega Jump. We're going to show it off in our next battle. So hopefully we see another White Club soon. Oh, a save point. That's good. Also, that means something. That means something. Always take the save points. Sometimes this game likes to throw... This game is surprisingly hard at times. Also, this is very good. Well, let's go inside, huh? Whoa, we can see ourselves. And we are in. This is the boss area. We are now in the castle. If we go here, there's a lock. So clearly, let's not go this way yet. Because last time I checked, there was a door here too. 
Another save point, might as well use it, cause why not? It, it can't hurt. Looks like we can't go in there yet, but let's keep moving on. Is that a new enemy I see? Alright, it is, so we're gonna switch to Lackalester. Alright, this is a white bat, I think, or a snow bat, one of the two. Oh yeah, great. This is what Star Storm's for. But yeah, you would need a hammer throw to hit these guys. And I don't have hammer throw on because I don't really care for them. Because yeah, once you get them down, that is literally what Lackalester's for. You get a spiny surge going and they just all die. But yeah, I didn't- Oh, I didn't look at the names of these things. You already seen it at the top right of the screen, so you can tell- So, I'm probably- If I'm wrong, I can just eat my words that way. And six star points! Just enough for a level up! Alright, so. Tough decision, tough decision, tough decision. Nope, FP, easily. We're just gonna get the max FP and just keep going. We need to get as- Ooh. We need to get as much FP as possible from here on out. Because we're about to hit some pretty spicy gameplay. So yeah. Like, I think after this I'm just not gonna stop using- stop getting FP. I think this is like, from here on out, it's just FP action. But yeah, let's show off Mega Jump, and this is a Swoop Lupa. Swoopula. 10 damage, that is amazing. But yeah. Their whole mechanic is that they take out so much HP. So button mashing is a necessity here. Okay, okay, one more button mash. Okay, okay, you can just hear the button mashing going on. Because I do not like the button mashing at all. 10 damage, oh my god, that is still so good. Now remember, if you ever get like, oh god, I'm using all my FP, remember, there is a heart block right outside of here. So you can just go back at any time and use that real quick. It cannot hurt to just go back and use the heart block. Because when it comes down to it, even if this is the most comp second most complicated dungeon you'll ever be in, it's not that difficult. But yeah, these Swoopa Loopas are honestly... I was honestly a little worried about the Super Lupus. Like, I still am. Because these guys are kind of doing a pretty good job against me right now. Like, I'm almost down to half HP already, and half FP. I've just been fighting Super Lupus. But that's not the point anymore. We got our eight. Ooh, Burly's gonna double it! It's a good time to double it, too. Look at that. Oh, I have to go back and get more Merle. I have to go back to the desert and get Merle to do that again. Because, trust me, it, it, it always helps when you need it. Anyways, let's get our key, because I know this is a key, because I practice. But last time, it said a blue key. Last time I checked, there was a red door. Well, I guess that will be a good time to introduce you to the mechanic of this area, which I hate ever so much. So we jump on this, and we do our little ground pound thing, spin ground pound, and we change the door. This one's blue. Last time I checked, we had a blue key. So yeah, we're just going to use our blue key on this door, and we'll go on through. And yeah, so this is a, basically, it's going to be using a lot of your characters, like Bombat. It's going to be using Cooper. I don't think it's going to use Paracarry, but that's not the point. Get Lackalester out. And this is a very important moment. First, let's get these coins. This is not as important. I just like the coins. But you can go through now. You can be at the other side. And yeah, now we're gonna get double the coins. It's not a mirror. It's a double you can it's actually just glass. You can now go through it at any time. I think it would have been proof if you noticed when I did the bomb before, the other side did not blow up. Anyway, let's go through. Yikes, Mario's here! Whoa, we better beat him! It's these guys again. I've already shown them in our last video, so I'm not going to have anything in the top right of the screen right now. But yeah, that 10 damage. It's pretty nice, isn't it? Ugh, I keep, I keep, my button matching skills is just going down. But yeah, these guys are really easy. They're, they're honestly a joke. Like, I'm not even going to use any more FP now. 
like there's no need to. They don't do a lot of damage. They're not really difficult to figure out the timing score. And it's like, they're really easy, so there's no reason to worry about them. It's like, whoa, he turned into Bombette. That's not scary at all. Why? Because I'm about to beat him. It's not like his stats change when he turns into Bombette. Anyways, that was him. That was pretty- those were those guys. They're pretty easy. Well, let's follow them. Oh yeah, Mario gave a thumbs up, but I just kind of speedy span right through it. Anyways, you can now go through this door, right? I actually want to go back out this way. Now that we're here. You go through here, and you can find a star piece. Pretty well known star piece, even I found it, and you know I'm all- you know I'm terrible at finding the star pieces. But anyways, now that we're back here, let's go through this door now. First, let's get this item. A super shroom. You want it. You just just take it. But don't say anything. Just get rid of your honey syrup. And swoop a loopa. Let me switch. Watt seems like he'd be the better choice in this situation. Alright, come down, super loopa. Yes, we got the first ray. Alright, that's good. That's good. Alright, yeah, so you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna get Watt. So go up there real quick. Yeah, he'll just do five damage. Watt is honestly... Watt is up there for probably being the best party member in the game. Honestly... I don't see any party members, in my opinion, other than Sushi and Lackluster, standing up to the might that is Watt. That's crazy, because those are the last three party members. Like, your early party members are only good in the beginning of the game. Like, maybe except B Lady Bo. But Lady Bo has issues against the defensive characters. While Lackalester, Sushi, and Watt, especially Watt and Lackalester, do not have this problem. Which makes them the most consistent in the game, the most powerful in the game, and the best party members just in general. It's hard to stand up to them when it comes to attacking. Alright, we're just gonna skip right through these, these swoopa loopas, because last time I checked, the odds of us leveling up this, uh, through this dungeon is not high. Alright, this is not a useful badge. It is not a useful badge at all. Do not take it. You're better without it. I'm going to fight these guys off screen. Oh, never mind. We have a new enemy. This is a yellow Magic Koopa. Also very easy. But if you want the XP, you better defeat it now. Using the healing. Told you it'd be useful. Alright, I'm back. I'm gonna start by saying I lied, only beat one of the party members, and oops, I ran into one, but hey. Alright, another new enemy, maybe, that's a red magic Koopa. But yeah, dupli ghosts, they're not hard. So anyways, we're just gonna start by letting the plane fly on through and it ruined this video. All you need to know is that I'm highly annoyed. Oh, great. Alright, these start these fights are starting to become very annoying. But anyways, yeah, plane fly through, I decided to cut that part out. But yeah, you just get a shooting star for coming here. Pretty great, I guess. You can always use a shooting star because I just used my shooting star because I was annoyed. And I just wanted to beat that dupli ghost because he turned into Watt. And I guess that gives me incentive to switch to sushi. Because sushi is until we get to the boss, sushi is probably your best option. I know I just said what is, but I like to, how do you say, I mix up my words from time to time. But anyways, next thing you want to do is, okay, give me a, what the, what the, okay, give me a second. I remember now, I remember now. Okay, so what we want to do 
I just remembered what I have to do next. I literally just realized. Okay, so what you want to do now is you gotta remember. You're gonna get lost just like I did because I forgot. Like a dummy dumb. Remember? The X was there. Alright, so we're gonna switch to Key Lack of Lester because we don't know what's down here. Yeah, you go down here. Go through all the. No enemies. Alright, we take it. Get on that out. The only party member we have not upgraded. Like I said. Yeah, here it is. Okay, now I remember. What? Who are all of you? Why are you trying to look like me? Mario, don't tell me you can't tell which one's a real Bombette. You can tell, right? Hey, I heard that. Star, you're spreading lies, you imposter. Star, I'm the real Bombette. Oh, no, no, Heart. Mario, look carefully at me and you'll know, Heart. I'm the real Bombette. It can only be me. Others are all liars. I'm the one, Mario, me, you don't fall for these tricks. I'll blow you up if you do. Uh, I'm the real Bombette. Uh, please, trust me and look at me. Uh, I'm not lying. No, can't bear this. Mario, smash the imposter with your hammer. All you pretend to be me, I can't take it another second. Oh, that's a nice idea. That'll clear this all up. Yes, good idea. I hate imposters. Mario, I'm the real Bombette, so don't you dare hit me. All right, so first you're gonna start by this one. No, no, I should have worked harder on my mom bad disguise. I will never forget this. Can I run away? This one now? What? Why did you hit me? Bless, you found me. What was wrong with my disguise? Hit this one. Oh, you were very smart to figure out I was an imposter. Curses, I thought we were doing a great job confusing you. I'll be back. And then lastly is this one. Oh, you managed to see through my disguise. Darn it, thought I was doing so well. Yeah, and then Bombette will be like, that was so great. Mario, if you hit me with a hammer, I was going to explode next to you. If you didn't, so I'm real happy that you knew I was real Bombette. And then she'll kiss you. Alright, let's move on. Yeah, so now you get this. Oh, Bombette's in the middle of the air! Let's just, let's just observe the sight of the party member in the middle of the air. Alright, now we're done with that. Yeah, we got the red key that opens the red door. Pretty obvious, right? That's good. Good for you all to know. Alrighty, so... Uh, I think we can go on a little longer. I see no reason not to. We haven't really made that much progress. Like what, we climbed up the mountain and we got two keys? Most of it was just me getting lost. Like, we can go on a little longer. It won't hurt anyone if we do. Alright, let's get through. Wow, I'm Dr. Susan in it right now. Alright, to start off, you go over here, and you go back here, you go back to the other side. So, for now, let's start off by going through the regular door. And you'll see a club will be in the way. Who are you? I'm the great honorable Crystal King, so that I cannot let anyone pass. You have to no good, I'm gonna have to hurt you. Yeah, then you'll get to fight the white club and a gray magic club. I did not expect you. But hey. Alright, so, the start, probably gonna hit the green, gray match Koopa first, because these guys like to run away, and I want their XP. Uh, let's, ah, uh, alright, power bomb. Yeah, I got the 100% for once, perfect. Alright, so now the white club will hit, get our two, get our damage, and then we'll just go for a regular jump and jump, and yeah, it's done. And we'll get our three XP, my god. I'm pretty sure we're a little overleveled right now. And yeah, the other side, that club will go away. But yeah, there's another one. I won't let you, I won't let you, I won't, and I won't, and I won't, you can't. You have to go through me if you want to get past. It's another club, uh, and I'll have a white Magic Koopa and his friends. Alright, so I think we'll start with a mega jump. Just get the Magic Koopa out of there. Trust me, life is better this way if you get the Magic Koopa out right away. Because that Magic Koopa is going to just cause chaos. They may not, might not give enough XP for your liking. And oh my god, these guys are doing a lot of damage against me. But that's not the point. So damage is my own issue. I'm just bad at blocking while talking at the same time. And yeah, that's it. That's another level down. Get five more star points, and we're almost halfway to another level up. And that club will go down too. And as you can see, there is one more. So, I'm going to use one of my mushrooms, just make sure I'm at above half HP. You never know when you're going to need it. And then I 
think we're gonna actually switch to Cooper, because Cooper, I don't see any flying enemies coming up. Hey, did you hear me? I said I'm not budging, you got that? Do you have any idea how mad Crystal King would be if I let you get through here? I don't want him mad at me, so I have to teach you a lesson. Yep, alright, this is the last one. And then I think this is when we'll be done with the episode. I want to show off Fire Shell. It's so good. And yeah, look at that, 8 damage. Yes, that's all I want. Alright, we're going to hit the rest with the Shooting Star. And yeah, because Shooting Star is an item. You can get rid of items, you can get more of them. You can go back at any time. That's 10 XP, that's pretty good. Or star points, whatever you want to call it. And now the door on the other side will be open. But I think this is a good time to be done with this episode. We've done a lot this episode. We entered this palace, I got lost, and yeah. I think this is a good time to be done. Besides, I need to heal. Next time on Paper Mario, we will hopefully finish the Crystal Palace. Because this place does take a while. I'm not going to lie, it is a little difficult. But hey, that's okay. I will see you guys then.